I came to Maine because it's a great state to do really important research in, considering the CNET program is a National Science Foundation grant and the University of Maine is doing interdisciplinary work. With my research, it's looking at how is aquaculture influencing coastal residents, coastal communities, and we're looking at from a human perspective of what's the social suitability of aquaculture in Maine's waters. We're looking at real estate and seeing if there is a connection between the siting of aquaculture and real estate. And that simply would be if you have a lease near you, just proximity to you and your home, is that considered something good that would maybe increase the price of the home or considered something bad that might decrease the price of the home or there might not be an effect at all, so there would be no effect statistically. To date, there hasn't been a study that has been published that is looking at that in Maine's context specifically. We're taking a model that's been applied in many other contexts, many other coastal communities, but we're doing it in Maine and it will be important for policymakers to have a full and holistic snapshot of what's happening on Maine's coast because the coastal communities are changing, whether that's from climate change or whether that's from different economic opportunities coming or going. It's important to hold on to what makes Maine special, but also develop and further innovate other things like aquaculture or a working waterfront that will further Maine's special ability to attract a lot of different people from around the world. And our goal is to help inform this process as we move forward and we, we're mindful and thoughtful as we move forward and increase aquaculture production in Maine. There's a lot of great opportunity, but it's important that we have all parts of the process covered and researched. So that means the human side of it and the biological side of it. We want the oysters or the mussels or the salmon to grow well and be productive in that environment, but we also want the Maine residents and people who come to recreate here to also prosper and be able to enjoy Maine's coastline because it's quite multi-dimensional so I hope that we can help that process as we move forward.